previously in the Pokemon Gaia Nuzlocke. I guess we're going diving. Can I leave? Can I go get like a better water type for this? I need a better water type for this. You wouldn't be interested in helping an old man out, would you? The legends say that cosmic caverns were once meteors. I think this should be the first place you look. And now the journey continues. guys, welcome back to Pokemon Gaia Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we made our way here to, what is this town? Edishore Town. I need to remember these names at some point. We made our way here to Edishore Town. We helped find a Clefairy that was supposed to do an ancient, like, meteor dance or something like that. Uh, we basically saved the ritual and everything like that. Today, we are going to be making our way to Atsail City, which I think is to the east. Yeah, it's to the east. But before we do that, we're going to do a quick little teamer recap. Starting off, we've got Courtney, the Manetric, level 51, Lonely Nature, with the Static Ability, Rockin, Discharge, Spark, Bite, and Quick Attack. Then we've got Jack, the Gore Guy, level 51, Knife Nature, Pickup Ability, and the moves Seed Bomb, Shadow Sneak, Confuse Ray, and Leech Seed. Then we've got Molly, the Azumara, level 53, Brave Nature, with the Huge Power Ability, Rockin, Aqua Tail, Play Rough, Surf, and Super Power. Then we've got Oliver, the Fero, level 50, Relax Nature with the Keen Eye ability, Rock and Drill Peck, Fly, Pursuit, and Fury Attack. Then we've got, up next, Kratos, the Gigalith, level 51, Bashful Nature, Sturdy ability, and the moves Rock Slide, Headbutt, Stone Edge, and Iron Defense. And finally, we've got Roger, the Diggersby, level 50, Gentle Nature with the Huge Power ability, Rock and Dig, Tackle, Bounce, and Hammer Arm. So, that is the squad right now. Um... It's going well, and I guess we're supposed to go over this Gyarados Bridge. I'm going to fight these trainers just for the sake of experience. Uh, nope. Not you. Maybe you. There you are. Alrighty, I can fight you. Discharge that thing. Skarmory, discharge that. We're a little over-leveled, but, uh, that's fine. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, what about you? Can I fight you? Nope. Alright. There's not many people I can fight in here. Oh, there. Alright. We're going to find out. But I guess this is all we can do. Oh, Gyarados. Hey. Take that out. Courtney's honestly just gonna run through everything we fight here. So, not that. Roger can take care of that, though. Okay, blow up on me, I guess. Staraptor, Kratos can handle that. Stone Edge. Missed the Stone Edge. Wow, I forgot you had that. Alright, well, gonna continue onwards. So, yeah, I don't know much about what we're gonna be doing this episode, but we're here in Atsail City, so... I guess that's one thing uh, that we can do. Nope. Where is the Pokemon Center? Here it is. There we go. All right, perfect. There we go. Um, anything else I can do? Uh, I need potions. That's what I need. Let's find out what we have for money. Do I have anything I can sell, actually? <clears throat> Are we still broke as fuck? Because I feel like we're broke as fuck still. Max Revive, we can sell that. PP up, we can sell that. X attack, we can sell that. Revive, we can sell that. Protein, we can sell that. Iron Dick, we can sell that. There we go. Got some money. Um, 98,000. Holy fuck. Uh, honestly, let's buy like 42. Um, full heals. Let's buy like 48. And Ultra Balls, Great Balls, Pokeballs. How many Ultra Balls can we get? 16, 32, we'll get 20. There we go. Alrighty. That works. Well, there's a gym here. We're not taking it on. We're going to go to Lomas Fields and uh, see what we can do all the way up north. What's the farthest we can go before we have to do anything? That's a Pikachu. Uh, Alright, spark it. Oh, it's got Volt Absorb. Wow, interesting. Uh, there's a twist. Throw Pokeballs at you. Hope we get you. There you go. Alrighty. Um. What can we name you? Um. Let's go. No. Um. I can play. Oh. I'm gonna go chew. Chew. Choo-choo? I don't remember what it is. I was going off of the manga. I think it's Choo-choo. 
So I may have fucked up there. I apologize. But, you know, we're just going to keep going onwards and, like, see how far we can get uh, around here before uh, we get too far. Or we're just uh, stopped from going anywhere. Because I don't feel like taking on a gym. I'll be real with you. Um, I'm not feeling the gym right now. So, and also, like, from this point on, I have absolutely no idea, like, where we're supposed to go. A Dunsparce would have been kind of nice. I don't know where we're supposed to go from this point on, um, because, uh, after Presimos, I didn't get that far into the, or the game ended, uh, for me. So I think really at sales all we can do, which is another gym, and I'm gonna be honest with you guys, uh, I don't know how ready we are for the gym, but I guess we're gonna take it on. I guess that's all we can do. Water types. Oh, this will be easy. Let's actually go back and heal before we do anything, because I don't think I healed. But yeah. So that's what... I guess this is what this episode's gonna be. I don't know. Uh, I'll be honest with you guys. Uh, I was not... I did not think we were gonna get to the gym this fast. But here we are. So I guess this is what we're doing. Oh, don't tell me I have to... I have to dive. I have to dive to get through this gym. Okay. Alright, well... Somebody's going in the box. Uh... Organized boxes. We need Clam Pearl. So, either you or you have to go into the box. And I think it's best that it's you. Because we can get, at least get a full turn out of um, Kratos. So we don't have to worry about getting O-Code. Uh, because we'll always have Sturdy. So... Yeah, I guess this is what we're doing. Ooh. This is actually really creative. I'll be honest. This is a creative thing. I kind of like this. But this gym looks like we're... Oh, I did should have checked who was coming out. Seed Bomb. There we go. I should have been paying attention to who was coming out. I literally only got 100 bucks out of her. Like, we're... Okay. That's the one thing about this game. Um, the amount of money we get is ridiculously low. Uh, we literally just got a hundred bucks out of a gym trainer when we're like, we're level, we're like in the fifties, dude. Like we're in the fifties and we should not be getting, like, we should not be getting that as our, like, our money for beating a gym or a trainer. So, I don't know. Let's see how much we get from this person. 700. That's still not that much with how far we are into the game. Like, at this point in the game, we should be going into, like, the thousands with how much, with what kind of money we're getting. So, it's a little disappointing that right now that's nowhere close to what we're getting. Can I? Thank you. So, yeah, I guess that's one thing about Gaia that kind of sucks. Or not sucks. It's not that it, it sucks. It's just a downer. Like, it just kind of, it's disappointing. I'm not wording this right, but it's just a little uh, disappointing, really, that we're making little to no money this far into the game, which makes it harder to buy stuff, which basically leaves us relying on um, being able to sell stuff, which is not something we should be having to deal with right now. So, you know, but hey, at least... Uh, this seems like a pretty easy gym to take out, because they're he's in the 40s. Which is weird, because I'm pretty sure we were on par with um, Will. So I don't know why we're so ahead of this, what seems to be these gym trainers. Unless the gym leader's just going to be on par with us. Whoa, that's my alarm. Holy fuck. Why do I have that alarm? I don't know. I forgot that alarm existed. <laughs> I'll be honest with you guys. I felt it vibrate, and I realized that was my alarm, and uh, yeah. I don't know if you guys heard it, but there it was. Okay, well, is this the gym leader? It is. Okay. This is a... Am I supposed to, like... Am I supposed to... Is there something I need? Ride the she shell. Splashes can be heard from above. Oh! Oh. I get it now. Alright. Um, I guess, hey. We should, uh... Probably take on the gym. And I, well, honestly, Jack and Courtney can handle this. So. Welcome, Challenger. You look like you've got something urgent to tell me. 
Well, I do not care for such matters right now. In the gym, all that matters is the roar of battle. Like relentless waves crashing against the shore, I will not hold back. Let's make this a duel to remember. Okay. Alright. I guess we're going to learn more about stuff when we get there. I'm going to just adjust my lighting real quick. That didn't really improve anything, so... Yeah, I guess. Can I make it better? That'll work. Fuck it. Alright, so this thing's part poison. So we're just going to skedaddle. Um, I don't know how many mods she has, but they're really low leveled compared to us, so... This is looking like an easy win for us. I'll be honest with you guys. Maybe I shouldn't have grinded up to level 50. Now that I think about it, I grinded up to level 50 because that's, um... I was at level 48. My highest mon was level 48 before I did grinding after we lost Soda Pop. So, I just boosted it. I went up a little more. There's a Gyarados on uh, coming out. And she's got five mons, and it, this looks like it's our Mega Gyarados, so... Interesting. Very interesting. Let's go for a discharge anyways. Got your mega ring on. That's fine. Okay. That's fine. Uh, I'm not too scared of a mega Gyarados. I'm pretty sure it has Moxie though. So if it has Moxie, that's that'll be a little scary. It lived, it's dragon dancing. Okay, that's fine. We can live one. Unless it aqua tails. Oh we outspeed it anyways, alright. Goodbye, Gyarados. Weren't fast enough to outspeed Courtney. That's for sure. This looks like it's going to be an easy gym. So, honestly, not too scared. Uh, Jellicent. I'll stay in. Uh, we should be fine. Yeah. We got nothing to worry about. If the rain could go away, though, that'd be lovely. Go for a discharge. And how much damage does that do? It almost kills. Perfect. Alright, that's fine. Taunt. Perfectly fine. I don't plan on using any non-attacking moves. Rain's gone. Uh, heals up. Alright. So... Discharge should put it back in the red. Or possibly if I get a high roll kill. Nope. I guess that was the high roll that I had. Let's go for a spark. Just get the kill. There we go. Take out the Jellicent. And now she's got like two mons left. Kingdra. Oh. Oh, wait. I have a... I have a fairy type. We're fine. Nothing to worry about. Honestly, having Molly on the squad is great. And, uh, honestly, having a fairy type in general is amazing. You have Flash Cannon. They were prepared. They were prepared for a regular fairy type, not Molly. Molly's resistant. That just looks like Zap Cannon, but, you know. Not gonna question it. Player off's gonna kill it anyways. Goodbye. There we go. Alrighty. So what's her last mon? Her ace was level 48. Which is a little weird. It's a little disappointing, really. That she was that low leveled, so. I was gonna, because I was gonna say, maybe we should grind uh, before we take on the gym. But wanted to just test out the gym leader, or the gym trainers. And with how low leveled they were, we were not gonna have to grind. Incredible! You've rightfully earned your place amongst the greats. Take from me the prestigious scale badge. There we go. Badge number what? Seven? We only have one badge left. Which means I should probably get the like next series uh started. Or not started, but ready. You never lost your composure during our battle. That's a rare for somebody so long. Young. Young. Prod prodigal talent should be rewarded. Take this. M45, what is that? That scald, it has a high chance of burning its target. Now what was it you what was it you wished to discuss with me? Matters relating to the tablet idol? I see. Meet me at At Sale Laboratory. We'll talk there. Come by when you're ready. Alright, well. So you have to find a way. Oh, never mind. Alrighty. Um Let's go heal up real quick. There you go. Alrighty. Um Uh, where's the lab? It's probably one of those big buildings down here. Maybe I'm dumb. What is this? At sale cold storage. At sale ra laboratory. Looks like just a boating house, but hey. All right. Hmm. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. I was miles away. I tend to zone out when I'm lost in a train of thought. Have you got the tablet idol? Yeah, here we go. 
Thank you. We've been waiting for this delivery for a while. That Redwood card, you know Charles? Of course, you're Nick. He told me how you witnessed the awakening of Roger Rock. We've been collaborating on Earth this earthquake issue. I suppose I should explain why I need this ta we need this tablet idol. Walk with me. Walk with me, talk with me. This machine can detect and recreate the energy from Pokemon moves. Think of, say, Hyper Beam. It's a devastating move. When a Pokemon fires it at a wall, there will be a residue all left over. This machine can find even the slightest traces of this energy. Our hypothesis is that the tablet uh, idol is connected to the tablets. But on its own, nothing happens. It needs a catalyst to activate. That's why we think a powerful Pokemon move is necessary. Of course, the issue is determining which one. I'll leave the idol to my staff to analyze further. Oh my, I've done it again. I'm awfully sorry, Nick. I'm late for a gym challenge. As a gym leader, I really should be more punctual. I've got a dash, but thank you again for your help. I'll get one of my aides to email Charles with the data. See you around. Alright. <clears throat> well, I guess that's it. Uh, where do we go next? Oh. And tell that to you, the rest of your buddies, too. Great timing, Nick. Did you see me totally wreck that new Elder Grunt? Pretty awesome, right? He was acting suspicious outside the Atzel cold storage. When I asked him what he was doing, he bolted. Then we had a Pokemon battle, and I totally beat him. Anyway, I think we should go check that place out. Who knows what those thugs are up to now? I'll see you there, okay? Alright. Guess we're going there now. Um, This is, you know, a lot being done in this episode, actually. A real talk. Oh, okay. Okay, well... Guess we're taking on the trainers, and they're really low-leveled. And this guy's got nothing but ice types. So, I guess Kratos should just go up front. Hey, that's a, uh, that's a Conkelder. We're gonna skedaddle. Joel Peck ya. Joel Peck ya. There we go. Alright. Um. Honestly, I don't need to be here, but... I want this ice heal. I guess I'll fight you. We are really high-leveled, actually. Like, we're pretty, we're pretty ahead of the game. I should also probably go get Diggersby uh, out of the box. So let's go do that real quick. 2016 uh, coin. Money. That's the wrong place. Let's go find the... I'm all over the place in this uh, episode. I'll be honest with you guys. Organize boxes. Give me you. And you go here. There you go. Alrighty. Perfect. Time to go. Back into the place. Guess is all we're doing this episode. Yeah, that's fine, actually. Okay. Well. Uh, Seed Bomb, yeah. Because you can't really hit me. Oh, you have Rock Slide. Never mind. Wall Rain. Um, Courtney. And Discharge. There we go. Lovely. Um, let's put Roger up front for a bit. I couldn't let you pass even if I wanted to. The machine behind me needs the key to be switched on. Without the key, it won't budge. We need to find the key to the, for this forklift. They could have hidden it anywhere. I have a feeling it won't be in this room, though. It must be somewhere close to the city. Man, this is going to be like finding a needle in a haystack. It was green. It was green. <gasps> needle in a haystack. Hmm. Now nah, I'm going the wrong way. We're going to get this way. This is the way we're supposed to go. Needle in a haystack, eh? Maybe we should go check... The hay! <laughs> That's a Ledian, dude. Holy fuck. Nope. Um. Nope. Can I run? Thank you. God damn. I just got done farming the. the you hear? Gonna be a while before. Okay. Um. Needle in a haystack was like. Pretty obvious clue, so. Oh, forklift key. There it is. Alright, well, that was easy. That was, uh... Hey, at least they gave us a clue. So, I appreciate that. Which is actually kind of uh, entertaining, because... Uh, honestly, I, I kind of like having the bit of clues. So, it's nice. Whoa, you managed to get the key? You're amazing, Nick. Let's convince this guy to move it for us so we can find out what's really going on here. You actually found the key? Yeah, whatever. They don't pay me enough anyways. I'll move it for you. Nice going, Nick. Let's get down to there and find out what they're up to. Alright. Guess we're going. You hear that, Nick? There must be people down here. 
Let's try our best to keep quiet. I don't have, like, I don't have a flash mod. So, like, there's only so much I can do or find. See those crates? I don't. I don't see them at all. <laughs> we can hide there and we'll be in an earshot. Let's go. I think we've I think we've lo lo waited long enough. The public close to finding the public are close to finding out the cause of the earthquakes. If we only if we wait any longer, we'll miss our opportunity. Please, Morgana, let's move into the final phase. Know your place, Enoch. You don't give me orders. We're not here for your collective incompetence. The plan would be if it were not for your in incompetence, the plan would be going far smoother. However, I agree that this is our ac accelerate our plan. Eunice, you say that Regis has fully left its dormant state. Yes, ma'am. I can prepare for some for the mission right away. That's good news. And what if you what if Reggie steal Ezekiel? Still dormant, but it isn't needed for now. We should go ahead and, while we have the element of surprise. We've all had the ins and the have had run-ins with those two kids Professor Wood Redwood is working from. We should be ready for them. Agreed. It baffles me that the three of you lost to a child. If they get in the way again, I'll destroy them myself. Gather the resources while we'll begin the final phase at Ignis Roost. Yes, ma'am. I'm pretty sure that's the old lady we gave our book to at the beginning. Well, you heard the boss. Let's get to work. Interesting. Mm hmm. Must be a retada or something. Oh no! Whatever the final phase means, it doesn't sound good. Let's get out of here, Nick. There you are! Nick Crow. This is my good friend Mar Marina. I think I mentioned we keep in touch via me email. It was about time we meet up again. If only it were under better circumstances. Crow told us what you two overheard in there. All the other knights are there. The answer is the same old lady. Some old lady, Morgana. Hmm. <clears throat> that name doesn't ring a bell. Me neither. What, Nick? You met her in Relico Ruins? She took your book? Hmm. We should pursue them in Apex Temple. I agree. Nick, we may we, we may well be headed to the danger. Do you want to come now? Let's go. Good, let's not waste any time. Whoa, this place isn't snow wasn't snowy before. Weird, I thought that was a peak above the clouds. Let's let's head to the temple. Alright, well. I guess with that, we're going to end this episode on a cliffhanger. And in the next episode, we will continue through the Apex Temple, I believe is where we are. So with that, I'm going to end the episode here, you guys. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you do smash that like button. If you want to see more, make sure to subscribe to Charles and PC Party. Share your defense while you're on Twitter and Twitch at PC Bloodmaster. Join the Discord, link is down below. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like, comment, subscribe. I'm PC Bloodmaster, and I will see you guys next time.